Hi, I'm Michael Eisner here. I wish I could be with you tonight, but it's a little far to go as many times a year as I would love to. Uh, I'm here in sunny California. No earthquake, no mudslides, but a lot of fires. So I'm here in the smoke uh, thinking about uh, uh, the club. Let me say this uh, to begin with. Uh, of course, I'm disappointed in our performance so far. It is a long season. We have all the way till May. So I'm certainly uh, optimistic and positive. Uh, tough two settings in a row, uh, having a corner kick in extra time go against us. Uh, Coventry game was equally Disappointed in the last, what, 10 or 15 minutes giving up the two goals, especially with two players ahead on the pitch. Nevertheless, uh, I am positive, and I think uh, we have a great, a great team. And by the way, a great city, which is why we want to be involved with Portsmouth. Um, a great spirit, great fans. Uh, Love Fratton Park. And by the way, we have the best, I think, the best CEO in all of football. I looked around a lot. I talked to a lot of people. Mark Catlin stands out as an unbelievably professional CEO in football or anything else I could think of. So we've got the management. Uh, we've got the coaches. We've got a manager uh, whom I think has a history of pulling uh, squads together and turning things around and being a winning coach. Now, I'm sure Kenny is as disappointed as you are in how it's gone so far, but you know what? That's life. Uh, I've been involved with a couple of uh, big teams, and I've gone through down periods, uh, up periods, slow periods, hot periods. And by the way, our baseball team won the World Series, our hockey team won the Stanley Cup. But we had the same kind of moments of unhappiness. The, the criticism that we get from the fans is appreciated. Um, I think it's usually pretty smart. Uh, it's certainly meant to be given with high emotion. Uh, I mean, social, social media is, is what it is. Whether it's Brexit, uh, whether it's uh, our president here, uh, the anger and the hostility that comes out on social media is kind of a natural evolution of, you know, frustration. I do wish that it wouldn't come out at Fratton Park or at an away park. Our fans are our 12th player. And I think our fans, and the majority of them are this way. Uh, it's only a small minority, but the way to turn things around is not only on the pitch with our players, and our coaches, but also with our fans and the encouragement as has always been in place in Fratton Park. Football is an area of great emotion, which is why it's so successful and why I love it. And as a fan, believe me, when uh, we blow a, a game in the, in the last seconds, uh, at least I think uh, angry things in my head. But uh, I do want to say that I, I think that, that, that stability, consistency, all the things we talked about when we acquired the team uh, three years ago are still true. We don't want to be a knee-jerk management. We don't want to make uh, unthoughtful decisions. We want to be uh, studied. We want to be respectful of our fans. We want to hear our fans. But we want to do, as best we can, the right thing. So I'm here to say, uh, last year at the same meeting, I could say, wow, we're up there number one or two. We've won X number in a row. We're really rolling. Uh, this year, I can't quite say that. That doesn't mean I don't have the same passion as I've always had. Uh, Eric Eisner and Andy Redman are coming over for the next two games, sitting down with, with Mark and Kenny et al. to, to talk about uh, 
the squad, the team. Uh, you know, we're, we're working diligently on Fratton Park. Uh, we're thinking about how to deal with the walkway from the railroad station uh, to Fratton Park. We talk about uh, a lot, the Milton End and the development that we're on the cusp of presenting, if it hasn't been presented already by uh, uh, tomorrow night. But uh, that, that is only a part of it. The part that seems to be and is the most important is what happens on the pitch. And of course, we talk about all, that all the time. So I hope you have a great meeting. I know Mark will be there. Uh, vet your concerns. Talk about your concerns. Uh, but let's try to be positive. Let's support our players on the field. And I'm sure next time I have a chance to be there, uh, it'll all be in a more uh, up situation. It is now just the end of October. This league goes on till May. So I'm not ready to throw in the towel. And I don't think anybody else is. You'll see. Things do turn around. Anyway, great meeting. Thanks. Wish I was there. Talk to you soon.